in the big gum trees live the little gum nut babies, Snuggle Pot and Cuddle Pie live with their family among the leaves of the very tallest gum tree. One day their friend, Mrs Kookaburra, came to visit. Tell us a story, Cuddle Pie begged. Tell us about humans, dared Snuggle Pot. Mrs Kookaburra leant in close and began her yarn. Humans are as strong as the wind, swift as the river, fierce as the sun. Humans are taller than a big branch on the biggest gum tree in all the land. The younger nuts gasped and huddled in closer. I want to see humans, said Snugglepot. But what if humans are as bad as bad, said Cuddle Pie. We don't know what we might find. That's what makes it so exciting, said Snugglepot. Cuddle Pie seemed unsure. Before dawn, when everyone was still asleep, Snugglepot and Cuddle Pie crept out of bed. They were off to find a human. The road was hot and dusty as the two small gum nuts walked further than they ever had before. Where are you going? asked a big lizard, basking on a rock by the roadside. We're going to see humans, boasted Snugglepot. But only in the distance, added Cuddle Pie. Can I come too? asked the friendly lizard. And so Mr Lizard joined the friends on their adventure. As the sun travelled across the sky, the friends came upon a marvellous festival. There were nuts and blossoms dancing under glowing lanterns. One blossom was sitting alone, so Snugglepot asked her to dance. Ragged Blossom was so happy. When the next morning came, they prepared to set off once more. Where are you going? Ragged Blossom asked. We're going to see humans, declared Snugglepot. But only in the distance, said Cattle Pie. Can I come too? asked the lonely Blossom. And so the four new friends continued on their way. The friends stopped to rest when out of the bushes they heard a faint voice calling, Help me! Help me! They ran towards the sound. The four friends discovered a terrible thing. A baby possum was caught in a steel cage, crying for help. Who did this to you? asked Mr Lizard. Humans, whimpered the possum. What can we do? asked Ragged Blossom. Just then a great noise sounded on the breeze. Humans, humans, Cuddle Pie cried. The friends hid. It's a giant, murmured Snuggle Pot as he peered over a branch. It looks like us, marvelled Cuddle Pie. Rotten traps, the human said. Don't worry, little possum, I'll get you out. Snuggle Pot and Cuddle Pie looked on curiously as the human gently released the possum. I wonder if all humans are kind to bush creatures like that, said Cuddle Pie, as Mr Lizard helped the frightened possum. I hope so, said Ragged Blossom. The possum thanked the friends and went on his way. Hurrah, we have seen a human, said Snuggle Pot, but only in the distance, added Cuddle Pie. What shall we do next, asked Snuggle Pot, as they walked into the bush. And so began the adventures of Snuggle Pot and Cuddle Pie.